Hey guys, Technomentary with a video for you guys. In today's video, we're going to show you guys how to move your data and everything over from your Android phone to your iPhone. In this video, I'm going to show you guys what move to Android iPhone looks like. It's a really easy to move from Android to iPhone. And in this video, we'll show you how to transfer your contact messages, photos, and much more from your Android to your iPhone. So it's a really easy way to move things over. And a couple things you'll need for this is that you'll need a strong Wi-Fi. Make sure both of the phones are well charged or fully charged. If not, plugged into your charger, probably the best thing to do. And also make sure the phone that you're going to be transferring the iPhone has enough storage so if let's say you had around 50 gigs of stuff in this phone you want to make sure the phone has at least 50 gigs or so or else it will not be successful and once you have all those you have a strong wi-fi connection you have a good battery charge or connected plugged into the charger you're ready to make the move and it's really straightforward a couple things you want to do is first things on your android phone go to your play store here that you have and then once you're in the Play Store, look for this app that says Move to iOS. Once you have that, go ahead and get that installed on your phone. And once you have that installed, we already have that installed here. As you can see here, it is already installed for us and ready to go here, Move to iOS. Once you have that, go grab your iPhone that you have. And this method will work on any of the newer iPhones that you have you're going to be at the setup screen and make sure you have the setup screen this is where it's possible once you're at the setup screen here you're going to go click on the language and the country of course and then you're going to do what's known as setup manually this is where the move to ios happens here so once you have done that you're going to want to go ahead and connect to your wi-fi there So we're going to go ahead, connect to our Wi-Fi, make sure both phones are connected to your Wi-Fi and the Wi-Fi signal are, is strong or you're close to Wi-Fi. You don't want to be out of the Wi-Fi range. And once you're that, that, give it a few moments for the iPhone to go ahead and activate. This is just sending the data to Apple server to make sure the phone is good. And while we're waiting, uh, you want to make sure the other you want to go ahead and fire up the move to iOS app here on the other device that you have. And once you have done that, we're going to hit continue for data and privacy setup later. And all of this, you can set it up right now. Uh, but for our purposes, we're just not doing that. And we're going to go to the step basically where it's app and data. We're going to get to this app and then you'll see there's the option to move data from Android. We want to click on that and once we click on that it's going to tell us hey go ahead download move to iOS app on your Android device or tablet so you can uh, transfer your photos messages and much more. We have done that already and now we're going to hit continue here and continue here and once we do that here as you can see it's going to say do you agree to terms and condition of course you have to agree to terms and condition and then allow access for you to be able to do this and we're just going to allow the access here for all of this and once you have done that as you can see there's a code that displayed here we're going to hit continue here and all we're going to do is enter that code so we're going to go ahead and type in that code and once we have done that it is beginning uh, the connection here as you can see here the connection is happening right now and it's authenticating and as you can see here the screen has flickered as well here and now we're waiting for as you can see this device is uh, device name is here and we can see here we're going to get options to select what we want to transfer like a google account your messages for example we don't want google account maybe we want messages only and other things if you have photos and such it will come up here you're going to want to select those as well that you want transfer and as you can see here the transfer is happening this is by the way is very fast because on this other phone the samsung S8 that we have as you can see here there's not much going on here so that's why it's being really fast we didn't have much to begin with and as you can see here the transfer has been done and this has completed and we're going to go ahead set up of course you need Apple ID and much more and just keep on going through setting up your Apple ID that you have and agreeing to terms and conditions all of that till you get to the main screen 
couple things here that's unfortunately you can't transfer with this method things like pdfs books music and apps that aren't available on the iphone that's available on the android phone things like that will not transfer over you're gonna have to do those manually by doing a transfer through by sending it through messages or some other way of finding compatible apps even pdfs you're gonna have to add those through because they are not easily converted or transferred over so hopefully this video is helpful for you and moving from android to iphone if this video is helpful please make sure to hit that like and subscribe button also if you guys are in the market for your know, samsung phone or one of the newer iphones make sure you guys check out the discount link in the description section as well thanks for watching guys see you guys next time